not skinny. I just saw the most amazing thing in my entire life. Yeah, technically we are no longer in Oregon, as we are staying just over the Astoria Bridge in Washington. But we do have a day to explore. So the next day we cross back over to Astoria. I don't cry when it rains no more Or I get dirt on my shoes I don't mind climbing eight more floors Cause these stairs are all here Nothing like waiting for construction on a bridge. Makes me feel a little uneasy. parked in the Safeway parking lot uh, down the street so we don't enter the neighborhood with our big old truck I'm trying to be respectful uh, we're gonna walk over to the one and only light in order to cross the road and then we're gonna walk up the neighborhood to take a picture in front of the house in the distance. Oh, wow. Right. Oh. Okay, a bit hard to see, but the truck is parked right there. And then there is the house. I started to wonder if we were going to be the only ones here, but the closer we're getting, the more people you see walking. Private drive, no cars, okay to walk. Um, and you can cars. tell there are other people up here. So if you drive a small car, you can park right there. But if you drive a dually, don't be that guy or girl. There it is, Braxton. The Goonies. Social media right here. Braxton taking a picture. But don't be fooled. We're not the only ones in the driveway. This moment right here started two months ago, back in Bend, Oregon, when we visited the last blockbuster on Earth. So we could get these? We don't have a way to play that. As we stepped into this time machine explaining our youth to Braxton, we wondered what would be the most iconic movie to get. Then we remembered that The Goonies was filmed in Oregon and we would be there soon. So we got the Goonies. Oh, and don't be fooled. We got all the movie candy too. Bye Goonies. On to the next one.
As we walked back to the truck, we couldn't help but admire some of the Victorian architecture in this neighborhood. On our way to downtown Astoria, I had to pull over to see this pilot boat, the Peacock. Over the past two winters, we loved watching the pilot boats going to and from the massive freight ships entering Laguna Madre at the South Padre Island, Texas. And we have learned since that maritime pilots have one of the most exciting and dangerous jobs one could think of. I mean, you've all seen this clip before, right? Yeah, that's a maritime pilot. So to see a pilot boat up close and learn about its history, that this one is known throughout the world since it navigated the Columbia River for over 33 years, was quite special. Who knew that the Columbia River bar is considered to be the most dangerous bar on Earth? I was waiting in the undertow Set a trip to fed away like bones Unaware of where my heart would flow I was waiting in the undertow All right, we made it to the Astoria Column. Um, note to self or note to anyone wanting to come by. It's $5, they do accept credit card and they stop you immediately as you come up. A little tight with a dually. There is a little parking lot off from the main entrance that the dually fits in just fine because on the main loop around it, there's no way. The Astoria Column was built in 1926 and is 125 feet tall, housing a 164-step spiral staircase. Which allows you to go all the way to the clouds to see all of Astoria and the mighty Columbia River. Definitely not for anybody that is scared of heights and not uh, for anybody that is scared of confined spaces. But, hey you guys! Hey you guys! So apparently this is a thing. So make sure you go to the visitor center and get a plane first. Unfortunately, we ran out of time to explore more of Astoria and our next stop was Costco to stock up for our next big adventure. You know, it's crazy when you walk into a store and everything looks completely normal, like this Costco, right? It looks just like any other Costco we've been to, but then you find items that are so unique to the area, like this.
yeah, coming from Arizona, <laughs> not something you would ever see. Well, we are fully stocked for the next two weeks, exploring Olympic with our friends, the Taylors. So stay tuned for one massive adventure. Thanks for watching and happy travels. <laughs>